Over the next six months, 15 million people are expected to visit a trade exhibition that's just opened in Japan. Expo 2005 involves more than 100 countries and New Zealand is making sure it's noticed among the multitude. <laughs> Giant Japanese corporations, over a hundred countries, and in one corner, New Zealand. We get the opportunity to profile New Zealand in one of the richest markets in the world. Hi, konnichiwa, dozo. Welcome to the New Zealand Pavilion. This is what you get for $10 million. The centrepiece, a two-ton slab of prime West Coast greenstone. It's the essence of New Zealand, it's the heart of New Zealand. The theme of this expo is nature's wisdom. Now an economy can only grow in the 21st century by being in harmony with nature. Now New Zealand thinks it's got a lot to boast about here, but it won't have much time. Most visitors will only stay here about six or seven minutes. It's great. It's a big store. It was very beautiful. A big multi-screen hammers the green theme. Touch TV technology gives visitors another feel for the country. We want to show the natural beauty of New Zealand, but we also want to show that we're smart and innovative. That's why New Zealand's exploiting the latest Japanese cell phone technology. You just open your scan options on your phone, push scan, put it over the barcode with your camera, and it brings up the URL. Instantly on the phone, 90 pages of information, even video clips of New Zealand. My first impression, the wide nature, rich nature, technology is also kind of cutting edge. Exactly the image New Zealand wants Japanese to capture. Mike Tespers, One News, Aichi, Japan.